Guys, I really, really, really don't want to go through, keep on going through um, factorization, but I'll show you guys again real quick. I'll do this actually two different ways. We can break this down into factored. If I was going to use my factor tree, I could say 6 times 2 and then 3 times 2. So the square root of 12 is 3 times 2 times 2. Square root of 75, I could say 25 times 3. And then that can be broken down into 5 times 5 times 3. So therefore, I can rewrite that as plus the square root of 5 times 5 times 3. Okay, And then minus the square root of 3. Well, ladies and gentlemen, the reason why we do this factoring tree is because I can take the square root of pairs of numbers. Should we write this down? So the square root of three times two or two times two is two. Square root of three. The square root of five times five is five times square root of three minus the square root of three. Now the whole purpose of simplifying them is now I have the square root of three for each and every one of those terms. So now I can subtract. 2 plus 5 is 7, minus 1 is 6. 6 square root of 3. Now, I will say, guys, if you're going to always be doing